We are calling our special meeting to order this morning, and I am hoping and hoping to get them in to lead us to the flag. I can. Flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. At this point, I am very happy and proud to you that we elect the following slate of officers for the 2022 year. In the uh, position of president, Mrs. Callahan. In the office of vice president, Mrs. Atwater. Mrs. Covell will hopefully be here and serve as our secretary. And Mrs. Welsh Treasury, Gregory will continue as treasurer. Do I have a second, please? Second. We have many seconds. Is there any discussion? Anybody would like to have alterations to this slate? Different slate? Oh, I'm just making sure. Well, then, Mrs. Callahan, would you like to conduct our last roll call vote as secretary? Certainly. Uh, Mrs. Atwater? Absolutely. Mrs. Gregory? Yes. Mrs. Thompson? Yes. Mrs. Vaughn? Another absolutely. And Mrs. Callahan? Yes. Thank you. Oh, and here is our new secretary. Here is our new secretary. And at this point, Mrs. Callahan, I have to hand off the gavel to you. If you'd like to please continue our meeting. All right, here we go. Well, we have a couple of discussions. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yes. 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 yes, Yeah, see, I've got my gamble. All right. We have a couple of discussion items today, um, the first of which is to talk about our committee assignments. So um, let's start with the finance committee. Um, at this point, Mrs. Gregory, I think you agree that you'd like to be the chair of that. Um, any comments or who else is going to make up the committee? Do you want to let us know uh, what those are? Gregory, I believe the committee is long, and then Ms. Long's any discussion or comments about the finance committee? All right, and then Mrs. Atwater, would you like to talk to us a little bit about the curriculum committee? Sure, um, I would be delighted to have Becky Houston. Um, I would like to remain as the chair of the curriculum committee. I, I, I should have said a couple of things before we actually we did that switch. We're all talking about it. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, uh, I, I think we, we operate well and we prefer to keep that. So it would be you and Mrs. Chine and Mrs. Colbert. Correct. Okay, good. Um, any other comments, um, Kristen or Kristen, about the committees or the review? No. no. All right. Um, then I think the next action item we have is to approve the minutes of our regular board meeting from December 20th. Do I have a motion to approve those? Second. And I think we thought it would be fun to do a roll call vote to approve those. So would you like to give it a whirl? Uh, yes, <laughs> you need a roll call vote to approve. Ms. Fawson? Yes. Ms. Gregory? Yes. Ms. Atwater? Yes. Ms. Long? Yes. Ms. Callahan? Yes. And Ms. Covell? Yes. All right. I, I, uh, I, everything was approved. We're a good count. I'm good. Okay. All right. Um, at this point, we will open it up for public comments. If there's anybody in the community that would like to make public comments at this time, the podium is over here. Um, limit your comments to three minutes if you want to. See if there are none, I think we can um, move on to uh, have a motion to adjourn. Do I have a motion to adjourn this organization meeting? Before we do that, I, just, oh. I want to take the opportunity to take the hand. Do it quickly enough, I guess, when we are looking at the discussion with the national officers. I, I just, I, I wanted to take a moment to thank the current officers, primarily Mary and Paul. Uh, when we, you know, you have served and done an amazing job in that role. And the last election, like six years ago, when you told me that was going to be your last term, I did not imagine that we would be going through what we've gone through in the last two years. And it has been uh, an honor and a pleasure to serve with you. At that point, I guess when you said you, that was it, uh, that would be the last one, Doug was president. I'm not sure that you were speaking that you thought you would be succeeding him, um, and that it would be like this, but I, it, it really it's, it's been an amazing couple of years, and I think you've just done an outstanding job, and I deeply appreciate this service you put in. When it became clear that your business was taken a lot, and that you told us months and months ago that it was also going to be your final term. Um, you know, I felt the same thing, that this has been a pleasure and an honor 
to serve, and I'm really looking forward to this last year, and deeply appreciate that you both are here to kind of guide the next, you know, the next group through and help us each. That's super fun a lot. I can't help but want to add on to what Marty said also, just in simply saying that this, being on a school board is so complicated. There's so much information to learn. I mean, not just about finance, but also about curriculum. Um, even for somebody who knows a lot about curriculum, there's so much to learn at this particular level, and it literally takes years to be able to really get to latch on to that. And so truly, your leadership has helped me learn how to know all the things that I need to know, and be a member of the school board. It takes time. And it was so necessary to have that experience to uh, be able to guide me. So I just, I really appreciate that. It, it helped me survive. <laughs> <laughs> and as, an, as the newest member on the board, I want to echo the same thing. I'm like, coming into a role on the school board, I really had no idea how school boards functioned and what they did and what, you know, more importantly, what they don't do. Um, there's just so much information and you both have been just a treasure trove of information and also really patient when I ask questions <laughs> and you go, yeah, no, we covered that, but it, in one year or other, just because of the sheer volume of information that kind of comes in and I'm glad that these women will still be around for several months to help, you know, continue providing all of us, especially if he is you know, there. Thank you. You were so sweet. I know. That's very sweet. Very sweet. It was just funny because Mr. Josephson, being that you know, I hung out for 12 years together, had to call and say, what are you thinking? And we were reminiscing about six years ago, right about now, we were both going to step down. And we decided in these crazy times, who could imagine that having two people step down at the same time would be a lot, and that one of us should stick around. And, so it went. Little did we know, but you guys are very sweet. It's been a pleasure, and we're not going anywhere. It'll be very fun to see people in new roles and interacting with this phenomenal organization to make it the best it can be. So thank you. Hi, um, I'm reserving my comments. Well, I have one short. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I meant. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. For sure. All right. Um, any other comments at this point? Otherwise, I'm looking for a motion to adjourn this organization meeting. I need to be adjourned. This organization. Yeah. Yeah. We are. Yeah. Sure.